making a metal base for some backyard stadium seats. These stadium seats are from Riverfront Stadium in Cincinnati, Ohio. Uh, when they took that stadium down, my friend acquired them. Um, the challenge with these is, you'll see here, there's five seats, six legs in between them, but three of the legs mount, mount flat or like into the ground where the other three mount to the, and the stadium would have mounted to the vertical riser for the, the row, the next higher one up behind it. So figuring out a way to, to make that happen. Um, I started out with some leaf springs, cut those apart. And when I test fit them underneath, um, they just bounced more than, than, more than anything. It bounced way too much. So I got my son here and did a test fit there. We had some two by fours underneath it. And that test fit, when you flip the seats up, actually found that um, it was just the two by fours at the time there, but they'd be kind of something you'd stumble over if you were kind of walking down the line. So I came up with this. Uh, it's uh, the metal I found is industrial racking. It was being recycled, so used it. Cut the uh, cut the angle there on one end of it, and then smashed it down and tack welded the corners to the, the side positions there, just to make it a nice subtle kind of angle in the front. And then when the seats are flipped up, uh, you can walk right by it. Here's my son helping me with the welding. Uh, he's learning at an early age, so get him involved in these projects. There's the finished uh, angled sections. You can see where they're tacked there in the corner and then ground down. And then here I'm test fitting the, uh, the flat mounting area um, and building that section so I can have the, the kind of the, the three easy mounting points taken care of first. Um, got some just hardware down at the local big box store. Um, to get the vertical section, I did one of the horizontal, or took, took some of that industrial racking and laid it horizontally and matched it up with those vertical um, areas that the three vertical legs that it need to be mounted to. Once I got the height correct, those spacer blocks there, um, cut those to size, welded those in place. And here um, I'm, I was originally gonna go with just the three legs under it, but once I tested it, uh, the, like the, I would just do the three legs going forward and underneath the vertical sections, I wasn't gonna have any, but I wound up finding it flexed too much. So got that put together. Got excited once I got finished with the project, took it right over to my buddy's house and uh, delivered it to him. Got it, here's the finished product out on his patio. This summer we were able, we were able to enjoy it with the kids and stuff. I actually watched a Sandlot a movie in his backyard, had a, had a movie night out there. Hope this helped you if you happen to have stadium seats and you're looking for a sturdy base or a way to make it. Hope this option works for you.